Who to look for for good quality content? There is not a single Genshin content creator that makes good quality content. The only person that makes good Genshin content in the Genshin Impact community, guys, is... Probably Gen Shashin. <clears throat> if I'm being real with you guys. If I'm being real, real with you guys, you know. You got, you got, the in the whole landscape of YouTube, guys. In the whole landscape of YouTube. There are people who are like, actually, next level ideas. High production. And then you have a bunch of us myself amongst many others who just sit down in their home playing a video game and get an editor to add a fancy few cut-ins and zoom-ins and a little bit of some titling now if that's good content to you good because that's what i do so please please consider that good content please please keep believing that that is high quality good content <laughs> but in terms of like actual top tier god level content i don't actually think anyone has really hit that level in genshin if i'm being brutally honest guys i think a lot of us are riding genshin using personality and not really high production value now, for a lot of people, obviously, personality equates to content, which is fine. For me, that's the same as well. Like, I enjoy basically all the streamers that I watch. I like their content. But if you were to objectively ask me, without my personal bias and attachment to them, if I thought their content was, like, high production, high quality, this channel over here, called Gen Shashin, This is high production, high quality, very creative editing using the in-game tools and resources that there is. See, like, th this is high production. Good editing. Now, if you compare this to anything I have ever done, this makes everything I have ever done in my entirety of my Genshin Impact life look pathetic. Right? Everything, any video I've ever created is worse, in my opinion, than anything. this video. This video is better than literally everything I've ever created. So that's what I mean. But still, there's a lot of people who still enjoy my stuff because it's just personality. And like in this content, obviously, you can't really tell personality because this is like a meme video. But that's what I mean by in terms of like good content. Because for me, my kind of content style, guys, is I just steal content. I'm just sitting here reacting to this piece of great content. And suddenly that's my content now. Is that good content? I don't think so. But like, you know, I'm like the fairy tale of of Genshin Impact, like the anime. Like I'm like Black Clover or Naruto. You know what you're watching is garbage. You know what you're watching is trash. I like Sword Art Online. You know it's terrible, but you can't help watching it and you still enjoy it because you too are garbage and trash. So that's what I'm like, you know? Now this here, Gen Shashin here is like the premium of anime. Like Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, or Steins Gate, or Gintama, or Monogatari, or whatever is your premium anime that has like really well written stuff, really high quality budget, really good editing, really good storyboarding and direction. And then you have like the low budget of, you know, the Naruto mainstream, the Black Clover, Unga Bunga, and all of this garbage like me, Fairy Tale. Like, you know what you're watching is not good. 
Like the writing is like, it's as if it's written by a monkey. But you still can't help watch it because you have a little bit of attachment or endearment to that series. You know objectively that it doesn't take much intelligence to come up with a story that simple. You know what I'm saying? Like Black Clover, it's like the power of friendship. Ah, I'm losing. I'm losing. Ha ha. I powered up and now I'm winning. Oh, you have a power up too? Fuck. But guess what? I have another power up. Ha ha. Now I've won again. Move on to the next arc. Oh no, another enemy. Oh no, they're powering up. Ha. But I have a power up too. Oh wait, you have a power up. Fuck. Ah, but guess what? I have another power up. It's called Nakama, bitch. And then that's the story. It's not a very well thought out story. It's very simple. It's very basic. And it's like any monkey could technically write that. As long as you're good at drawing and you have cool looking characters, that's all that matters. And that's what I'm like, all right? So that's my level of content. You can't objectively say that Black Clover is trash, but in my opinion, Black Clover is trash. However, am I up to date with the manga? Do I read it religiously every week? Yes. Was I like that for Naruto? Did I watch the fillers as well, even though I knew they were garbage? Yes. Sword Art Online, have I rewatched season one of Sword Art Online the first half multiple times? Yes, I have. Yes, I have. And do I know every time what I'm watching is garbage and very low effort and not that amazing compared to stuff like this? Yes, I do. But I can't stop watching it because it's comfortable, it's enjoyable, and it doesn't require much of my brain to, to absorb, you know? So yes. <clears throat> you have ruined my day, Naruto and Black Clover, SSS tier. It's okay to have an opinion and it's also okay to have an incorrect opinion. And... The reason why is because having an incorrect opinion typically leads you to come into low quality streams like mine. So, so thank you very much for tuning into my stream and, you know, not tuning into other people's streams that have actual high quality content. So thank you very, very much. I'm just being brutally honest, guys. Like, if you were to genuinely ask me if I think anyone in the Genshin Impact community has, like, the actual top tier level of content that I have seen across YouTube very little especially compared to other games i've seen people go above and beyond for certain things i don't think anyone has really taken that step in genshin impact yet and there may be genshashing here and there's probably like some outliers as well people who make there's another video the anime parody opening let me see if i can find that actually that was really 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 good i thought that was really really good actually this is also what i would call very very high quality content like the amount of work time and effort this kind of stuff takes is unreal don't you think this is insane now if you were to ask me if any twitch streamer is putting out content of this level the answer is no that's what i mean that doesn't mean i don't like their content though because I really enjoy watching my friends still because they're my friends and I just enjoy their personalities. Give us a Genshin anime! Give us a Genshin anime already! See, and then we have... <coughs> then we have... Monstat Girls outfit changes into Bunny with Barbara looking a little sus. So, you know, there's content out there for, for everyone. So, you know... Content can mean many different things. Give you a Genshin anime so Atsu can do watch parties. Yes, absolutely. Tracy, beg your pardon. Small Radish, thank you for the tier one as well. Singista, thank you very much for the 100 biddies as well. Porio, thank you for the prime as well. So that's what I mean, guys. I'm not actually saying that people have bad content. I'm just saying no one has like that top tier level of content or realistically not many Genshin people have that top tier level of content i do think people can still take it to the next level if they wanted to but like the amount of time and effort to take it to the next level is not worth it for most people if anyone because it's Thank easier to something. just be a personality based content creator or be a build based content creator but yeah that's why i think you know genshin is a very 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 good category to grow off right now if you want to be a content creator genshin is the number one game to grow off right now because realistically a lot of people in the genshin impact community myself included we're just looking to be parasocial andes and find ourselves connected and attached to someone that's streaming or creating content or talking that's what we're all really here to do 
We are looking for friendship and family is, is the reality. We're, we're all parasocial Andes. It is, the, it is the sad, sad truth. Pepe W. It's not a bad thing, though. I am exactly the same. Which is why I lurk in a lot of people's streams. Because I like putting people on in the background, for example. Uh, so, normally, if I'm working, or I'm editing a video, I will have someone else in the background on, like a stream. And it doesn't sound like I'm living in silence and I'm alone. So... <laughs> So yeah.